everybody, it's me. Just thought I'd come on and do a quick little video. My boyfriend actually wanted one of these to help make things accessible around the home. Um, it's a label maker for Braille. And the way it works is pretty simple. Here's, um, at the top, there's a little, there's a dial with all of the alphabet on it. A through Z. S T U V. Yeah, and Z is right here. And then we go into contractions with the and in of for E R S T I N G E D. Dropped F, dropped E, dash, dropped C, decimal point, period. Uh, dot six number sign. So that'll give us quite a bit to work with. And him, he can learn, you know, different ways to use this. Um, you, It kind of reminds me of a... Back in the... I don't know if you guys remember these. But back in the way back day, like in the 80s, for you... Any of you guys born after 1990 might not get this. But back in the 80s, when you'd go to the store, they'd have people with these little guns. They'd basically be shooting out price tags. Like, like that's what I would hear throughout the store. And what they're doing is, this gun, they'd pull the trigger and a price tag would pop out. And they'd put it on the item. And they'd just go all around doing that. Well, this is... Like that, only we're not putting price tags on things, we're labeling things. So we just do like this. This opens up at the top, the, and this is how it's shaped, too. It is kind of, you know, a little bit like that shape. So you pull it up at the top, and this is where the tape goes in. There isn't any in there now, obviously. So here's the tape. It's on a little roll, like that. And now you just... Have to get it started. This is the hard part. Do I have to take this off for the tape to go through? Because it goes in here like this. And there's one mark here that is for cutting the tape. And you just twist, twist the label to whatever you need. And it has to line up with, there's a little notch on the front. And you just B. And then you twist it some more. Okay, like that. So, I think... Yeah, the tape is like inside of a plastic... ...device here. I'm not sure if it's supposed to stay in that or not. It's been a while since I've used one of these. Um... Oh, wait a minute. I think I figured it out. Okay. It's the tape. It, it kind of has a start. 
And then you just kind of work it. There it is. Okay. And this is like a guide for it, so it, yeah. Okay. So you, I pulled it. See, it's inside a ro this roll, and you just pull it out like that to get it started. And this plastic around it is a guide so that it stays on track. So you put it in there, like that, and then you feed it in inside here, underneath that. There we go. Now I think we can get started. Close it. Now, once it's in there, it's going to hopefully do that. So, let's say I want to label something drab. Because, of course I do. So, we do capital sign. And I'm not sure, can this go back? Yes, it does. Okay, cool. So it can go either way as far as um, the label, making sure it's right. There we go. So, yeah. Capital. Two capitals, because, yeah. And always make sure it's lined up with that notch. D. This is kind of slow and cumbersome, but it'll get the job done for him. R. Then back. A. Oh no, it's finally coming out. B. And then... And we... One over and... And then we can pull... And that didn't quite do it, so. There we go, that did it. Just, no, it kind of came out. So, let's try that again. Just so I know I've got it started. Dot six, dot six. This is good practice for me too. D. I also don't want to waste it, but it's okay. R. You know, I've been so excited today, I haven't had dinner. Or, I mean, lunch. A. B. And cut. And just give it a hard. Like that. And that should cut it. There. And then. Well, I got drab, just not in all capitals. Um, yeah, 
that. I don't want to waste this. So, but that's the drab, oops, drab label. <laughs> so, that's a little demo for you, and I will absolutely be back later because my package is coming soon as well. It is the Mantis Q40. I cannot wait to get this in my hands. It's not officially mine, but I'm borrowing it for a week. And that's okay, because I'm going to enjoy it completely while I have it in my possession. Have a beautiful day, everybody. Blessed be.